video. This is nothing edited. And what I have in the pot right here is uh, three tablespoons of melted butter with a two teaspoons of oil. That's because I don't want the flour to be grainy. I'm going to add a little flour to this. And I'm going to make that little flour roux that I've showed before in a prior video. Just going to do this enough to get the raw flavor off of the uh, flour. That doesn't take very long at all. I'm going to be making some uh, broccoli soup today. Right. I'll be adding to this a 14.5 ounce can of uh, low sodium chicken broth. All right, that should be. Yeah, I can't smell that raw flavor anymore. Okay, so I'm going to add that to this. I will also be adding for starters um, no, uh, half a cup of water. All right, to that I'll be adding a cup of diced onions. It's, it's diced up, it just looks larger. Okay. That's yellow onion I'm adding to this. a half a teaspoon of black pepper. Got a half a teaspoon of salt. To that I'm going to be adding four cups of broccoli florets, they're in different sizes, little small ones, large ones, large ones. Okay, add that to the pot. Not much else I can really do to this right at the moment. Um, bring it to a simmer, let it cook for about 20-25 minutes till the onions are cooked and tender and the broccoli as well. Um, I'll be back when I get to that stage. Okay y'all I'm back. It's 22 minutes into cooking this and it's tender enough to start adding the rest of the ingredients. So the next ingredient will be a can of Prima Bacon uh, Soup. We're going to try it. I've never done the broccoli soup with it but I usually put bacon in it but this time I'm going to use the cream of bacon soup and I'll be adding some uh, ham to it as well this time as opposed to the way I usually do it. Alright so I didn't have to fry any bacon this time. Yay! Alright. Alright let's get that in there just like so. Alright, stir that in. It's not working well. At least not for me. Okay. We have alright that's thickening up good. To that, I'm going to go on ahead and add my ham. It's about a cup and a half of ham. Yeah, 
I like that because it's thickening up. It's going to be a nice hearty soup. And then I have my Velveeta cheese here. That's a cup, a cup and a quarter. I'm going to add that. Give it a little taste here. Mmm. Oh, goodness. Okay, that was a good choice to use cream of bacon, y'all. Okay, I like that. That. A little more frying bacon to make uh, cream of broccoli soup. It's not going to happen. That's basically all there is to it. It's a nice creamy soup. I want I want the chunks of my broccoli in there. I've seen people put it in a blender. I've seen them use the hand blender in their pot. I have also done it. I'm not wanting the cream of uh, broccoli uh, cream of broccoli soup this time. I want the creamy broccoli soup with the large pieces remaining. So that's all there is to making the creamy broccoli soup. That's not cream. <laughs> this is uh, nothing edited. I want to thank you for watching my videos. Please like, subscribe, and by all means, please comment. And y'all have a great day.